Naam, kando na hayo. Afisa mmoja wa kijeshi alifariki baada ya shambulizi al Shabab lilotibuliwa kule Baure eh, County Elam ameziko mapema hii leo hapa jijini Nairobi. Maafisa wa kijeshi aidha ametoa taarifa kwa uso walohusika katika shambulizi hilo pamoja na miili ya washukiwa hao wa al Shabab kuonyeshwa hadharani huko Lamu. Mwanahabari Hussein Muhammad ametuandalia taarifa ifuatayo. Dua za kumfariji munda zake afisa wa jeshi sajenti Fara Abdi afisa anayetaja kuhusika pakubwa katika kutibua shambulizi lilofanyika katika kambi ya jeshi eneo la Baure kaunti ya Lamu He had served for 31 years with loyalty and dedication you can imagine 31 years <coughs> yeye ana ametoa yule maisha yake yote tukitoa ile maisha kidogo ya ujana 35 31 years akifanyia inchi na kuchunga inchi kazi si mtu amejitolea he deserves heshima uh, kubwa sana ilisha mkuba yake yenyewe waliofika hapa walimtaja kama shujaa na alijipa moyo wa imani na tumaini katika kazi yake amekufa wakati akitetea inchi amekufa wakati akitetea wananchi wa inchi amekufa wakati anataka inchi ipate amani amekufa wakati anataka alshababu waishi kwa hii dunia ambao anatuharibia maisha yetu ile ya kawaida ambayo tunaendelea nayo. Magaidi 11 pamoja na wanajeshi wawili waliuawa hapo jana huku wengine waliojeruhiwa wakiletwa mjini Nairobi. Now we appeal to members of the public because the Al-Shabaab who attacked uh, uh, Baure uh, KTF camp some escaped with minor and gunshot wounds. Whoever who resides at Karisa Wajia, Baure, Mangai, Ishakani. Seeing a suspect coming for treatment with gunshot wounds, she reported to security agencies for action. Kati ya wale usike katika operation hiyo ni Lukman Osman Isa, maarufu kama Shirwa. Lukman adaiwa kuwa kamanda mkuu wa Al-Shabaab katika mkuu opani na pia kutajwa kusika katika shambulizi la mpeketoni ambapo takriban watu sina watano wali wawa. Chini yake Lukman nasemekana kuwa mwingereza Thomas Evans, maarufu kama Abdul na Saida Hamasa ambaye pia anasemekana kusika katika beshara magari ya watali hapa nchini wali usika. I think looking at uh, the casualties on Al-Shabaab side where you see some whites, uh, certainly those will tell you that these were real some of the commanders. Most of the times some of these guys don't come to the, to the front lines but this tells you that they wanted to make a big hit Unfortunately, it didn't happen. So yes, certainly uh, those are commanders that have been neutralized and it's a big blow to the extremist group. Ni hivi majuzi tu mwezi wa Aprili ambapo zaidi ya watu 150 waliwawa kule Garissa kufuatia shambulizi la magaidi. Huku familia wapendwa na marafiki wakimpatia buriani ya aina yake munda zake ya mwanajeshi Fara Abdi wadadisi wa Sala Usalama wanasema kuwa ndio mkoko unaalika maua katika vita dhidi ya ugaidi hususan kupigana kundi la wanamgambo wa Al-Shabab Hussein Mohamed KTN Leo Nairobi